and welcome 11 commerce students today in this class i will discuss uh, with you the meaning of small scale industries different types of small scale industries before the msme d act 2006 now small scale industries was defined by industrial development and regulation act 1951 but later on uh, the definition was revised and according to the revised definition of 1997 uh, small industries include various types various categories of industries what are those uh, number one is small scale industry i will discuss every category one by one First is small scale industry. Under this industries, the investment in plant and machinery does not exceed 1 crore. Does not exceed 1 crore. It means less than. It remains less than 1 crore. Always. Uh, if the main emphasis of the industries is on export promotion the, and modernization, the investment in plant and machinery can go up to 5 crore if it is based on export oriented or modernization. Second is ancillary or small unit ancillary or small unit ancillary unit or small unit here what happens uh, the total investment limit in these industries does not exceed 1 crore the industries must sell not less than 50% of their production to parent units ancillary units have assured demand from parent units also the parent units provide them technical guidance as well as financial help so it does not exceed one crore here also it does not exceed one crore then comes the export oriented units comes the export oriented units what are export oriented units the small business units which export more than 50 percent of their production as referred to the are referred to as the export oriented units investment of this unit should not exceed one crore so here also one crore and they sell they export 50 percent of their produced units next comes small industries owned by, by women here the share capital should not be less than 51% uh, owned by the women. So this is, this is not so important, cannot be written also. Tiny industries, tiny units. Actually there are many. Talking about first is tiny units, then uh, micro enterprise. After micro enterprise, khadi and village. Then comes the small scale service. After then comes the cottage industries and agro based industries. Cottage industries and finally uh, after cottage industries we have agro based industry. Agro based industry 
So various categories are there as you can see various categories are there. So first we will talk about the remaining unit. From the remaining unit first we will talk about the tiny unit. Tiny unit here. Uh, any business unit which uh, whose investment in plant and machinery is not more than 25 lakh so not more, cannot exceed 25 lakh less than 25 lakh will be the investment then comes the micro micro here it cannot exceed 1 lakh more smaller than this smaller than this it cannot exceed the criteria in plant and machinery more than 1 lakh then comes the small scale service here the machinery investment in plant and machinery uh, including land and building does not exceed 10 lakh uh, the small scale in the service here does not exceed the criteria of 10 lakh you can see the variation in these uh, different categories then comes the khadi and village the khadi and village uh, in case of Khadi and village, um, these are the industries located in the rural areas which either produce goods and services or with or without power. Fixed capital investment uh, as per head worker in case does not exceed 50,000 less than this. So criteria is up till 15,000. It cannot exceed 50,000. Next is uh, coming the uh, coming to the cottage industry. Cottage industry is also referred to as rural industries, traditional industries, and uh, production of simple products, simple equipment is used, indigenous technology, small capital investment, uh, very small capital investment, maybe uh, less than. Less than 50,000 cottage industry and Khadi and village industry are almost same. So criteria will be same as Khadi and village industries that is less than rupees 50,000. Less than rupees 50,000. And now next comes the last comes the agro based industries. Agro based industries also uh, these industries include uh, the industrial products or supply inputs to agriculture so here also you can give it uh, like more than 50,000 to one not less than 50,000 uh, or it can lie between 50,000 to 1 lakh not less not more than that because farmer handle these type of industries and farmer are having less equipped they are less equipped they are having less capital procurement they are they can rent they cannot uh, raise so much of finance they are dependent on government and other subsidies so uh, their investment is also uh, having certain limitations they cannot exceed so much uh, no question of exceeding more than one lakh so here you can also write the investment criteria is less than fifty thousand or less than one lakh something like that so these are the different investment criteria according to the ms before uh, the msmed act 2006 so in my next class i will come up with another different topic from this small business it is a uh, very um, you know informative chapter you have got you have to know a lot of information about this investment because mcq will be based on uh, these type of investment type questions so variety of uh, short questions can come from this chapter uh, regarding the investment criteria. Uh, it has got a lot of information about the small since a small scale play a very vital role in our country so uh, this is a very important chapter and I would suggest you to go through the different objectives uh, that can come uh, from these as I have provided in the class, uh, whatever I have provided in the class. So till then, prepare this well, till then, goodbye.